All right, start streaming is on the way. And I hope we will stream. But let's first wait again for the stream to start on YouTube and then pause it and then continue with our amazing stream today. Today, it will be, huh, hmm. It will be difficult. It will be hard. It will be, you know, I'm not sure I will be able to do it, but hopefully I will. So let's do it now. Okay, we will do the head first, as always, a big neck. This time we will need a lot big neck, a lot of bigger neck, a lot of bigger neck. I'm from Italian. I'm Italia, from Italia, Sicilia. I've been to Sicily, uh, by the way. Been to Sicily, been to Bologna, been to Rome a little bit. So I've been into Italia. Buongiorno. Piano, piano. Lasciatemi cantare. Sono a mi piano. Lasciatemi cantare. Yeah, I know those songs. I mean. Okay, now, ears, of course, like always. Hello, everybody. When you write Zdraveten of Sitchki, nobody will understand. Maybe hello everybody will be a little bit better. Probably. And you know, the chat English, the official chat lingu uh, language is English. The official chat English is English. So, <laughs> English is English. Yeah, English is English. It's, it's like life is life. Life is life. Na 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 na. La da da tap tap life. Love from India. Thank you very much. The bo the best voice. The best voice. The voice of the eclipse. Yeah. I by the way love. Uh, I used to watch a lot of StarCraft videos on the web. Now not not so much, but just an year ago, I watched all the time StarCraft. Now not so much. StarCraft two, I mean not. The original one. Oh, yeah. No time for these things anymore. Nowadays, what I watch, politics. Yeah. Since the war, what to watch? Why do you start with separate parts and not together? Ah, that's interesting. Because the, uh, the head needs way more polygons than the body. If I start them together, of course, what will happen is the body will have too much polygons and blender will die or something like this it, it's not gonna be pretty so we don't want that we want everything to be peaceful and nice and quiet and just you know so so cool so that's why i do it i do it for your own peace of mind because when blender dies it screams it in tears it like it's blood everywhere and we don't want that on the stream i mean even YouTube probably will be censoring that, so we will not have the stream even for long. It will be like a few minutes and then gone. Somebody will report it and it will be out of the window, you know. So we don't want that. Now, yeah, sculpting the head separately, we kind of avoid that. Hope now you know why I do that. Now I know only I can sculpt with sphere. Only I can sculpt with sphere. Yeah. Uh, at some point we will have to, you know, remove the symmetry, especially for the nose, because it will look way better without symmetry, obviously. But for now, we are fine with it. In the beginning, I always sculpt with symmetry, so. Yeah. Good day everybody Nico are you willing to make a character sculpt course in blender in the future really really why are you asking me this <laughs> since I have already like five of those maybe another one yeah of course I will because that's my plan I will do such courses more and more I have around maybe five already but I will do more that's a tricky question, probably. You want to trick me into something. I don't know. 
So it's a little bit, you know, um, to make this character for like two hours, let's say two hours. <sighs> Even it's stylized, but still it will be a little bit uh, of a stretch. By the way, a guy from the chat, Igor, he showed me the concept. Just this morning I saw it in YouTube, uh, in uh, Facebook, and uh, I said, hmm, this probably will be difficult to do in just a few hours, but then I tested it. And it seems that there is a decent result. It's not exact, you know what I mean? Not all the details, but it's a decent result after just like maybe two hours. So I think it could be fun. That's why I'm doing it. Amazing, right? I just discovered you days ago and I'm already in love with your work. Amazing skills. Thank you very much. My work thanks you because you are in love with my work. By the way, um, yeah, hopefully you will not want to marry my work, which I don't know how it will be, uh, but thank you anyway. It's it's fine. I'm, I'm joking, of course, like always, but uh, yeah, don't worry. It's fine. Now, let's make the mouth but the mouth will not be visible at all so we will just uh, make something like a mouth not too big not too small we don't care about the mouth we will put the mustaches and it will be amazing the mouth is just for fun i will put the mustaches you will see it will cover everything and it will look much nicer so god of war uh, most of the time is a very easy character to sculpt because of the beard and you don't have to be very good in uh, face anatomy to do it that's why I'm doing it so yeah now we have not night outside what's happening what is happening here the chat is going somewhere in a, somewhere that I cannot uh, really uh, understand what's happening but it doesn't matter I uh, have to sculpt here, so you can chat in the chat, and I will sculpt here, and we will be happy together forever. Yeah, everybody with their own business. Your business is to chat in the chat, my business is to make this model for less than two hours, if possible. But it will be probably a little bit possible, we'll see. So the ears are a little bit too much kind of pronounced, uh, you know, protruding from the skull. I will push them and then flattening this area, flattening the forehead. Okay, he looks nice. Now let's make the beard with one sphere, of course, like always. Put it here and this will be his beard. Amazing beard, as you can see. I think you all will love the beard now. So show some love for the beard. Everybody loves the beard. By the way, I stumbled to a guy. Uh, he has, I think, more than a million subscribers. I'm not sure exactly how much. But he is eating. Uh, com competing in eating. He's called uh, Beard Eats or something like that. this. <laughs> He's very cool. I like to watch his videos. He's pretty cool. And you see, amazing. Just in a few seconds we have a very good result already why because the concept allows it that's why i'm kind of uh, testing the concepts because if the concept if we cannot achieve something interesting for a few minutes uh it's uh, it will be difficult yeah do some shoes in blender so uh, you think that the shoes in blender are impossible to do that's interesting, but I have already done some shoes, I think, in my courses. So I've shown that it's possible, especially for Lobo. The shoes are, you know, pretty hardcore. You can check it out. Shoes in Blender, Lobo version. Amazing stuff. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun. I have to smash and flatten the sides of his head a little bit and it's okay now let's see what will happen here we'll have the neck 
and here this will be the traps and the neck i don't know what happens here around the neck but it's uh it's cool it's cool we'll have it it's fine he doesn't look exactly like kratos yet but at some point probably he will look a little bit better Okay, let's do a little bit of working here. Maybe a little bit more realistic stuff, so he can look more like Kratos. But yeah. I removed his uh, lower lip, because it's not in the concept, so we don't want it. If we remove the beard, it will look pretty weird, but it doesn't matter. The important thing is, I mean, the, the 3D is uh, like, um, all is a lie, you know, almost everything is a lie. So, you think that uh, below there, there is an upper lip, there is a lower lip and everything, but it could not be. Nobody knows. It's just a matter of, uh, you know, we'll see. <laughs> it's just a matter of, we'll see. Now let's make the body save from time to time by the way it's a very good idea to save let's make a big body big body forever now put it here and continue so it's very nice that he doesn't have hair because hair is difficult to make with a beard like this at least no food will be stuck in it ah uh, yes because he's a cartoon character and he doesn't need to eat probably maybe that will be the reason for no Let's see what he looks like. Yeah, pretty uh, wide shoulders he has. Let's make them. And then we'll see what will happen. Yeah, now uh, we have too much stretched polygons and stuff. So I probably would want to remesh and smooth and then continue from there. And when I smooth, I always, what I do always, I do the clavicle first. The clavicle is the most important thing. The clavicle and then everything will be okay. After we do the clavicle, we'll be able to do everything else, hopefully. Here we will have a shoulder. Let's see. Nico, hi, can you please tell me if Blender has a back face mask functional like in ZBrush? Yes. So yeah. Maybe your question should be where is it not if it does have but since your question was if it has my answer is yes and i show it in one of my streams i think uh, yeah so you should watch all of the streams just to see it what why are you doing this to me nico why are you so cruel i don't want to watch any of your streams i just want straight answer can you just give it to me you bastard. Why, why, why are you talking to me like this? What's happening? What's happening here? Why are the people these days so rude? I don't know. Or it, I don't know. Yeah. Is this the real life? Is this just fantasy, right? Hmm? Nobody knows. Now let's do a little bit flatter chest. I think it would be more appropriate. And thicker waist. In the concept he's pretty thick at the waist. So thicker waist. Amazing. Now this will be fixed. Eventually we will see how it will be. For now it looks good. Relatively good. I'm not saying it's the best. No. But it's relatively fine. My name is Count Dracula. Pleased to meet you. Sit here. Yes. All right. Hmm. Back muscles. I will not do the back because we don't have too much time. I will just do the things that will be visible in the YouTube thumbnail. I told you. I'm working only for the YouTube thumbnail. I don't care about anything else. The YouTube thumbnail should be good. And then the people will come and they will say, oh, how amazing stuff uh, this guy is doing. Uh, Nico is the best and uh, all these lies. 
and uh, everything will be okay. I'll be happy. You know? Classic troll Nico. <laughs> yeah, Nico is troll, Nico is a hater, Nico is all those things. But it's normal. I mean, I'm from uh, from Bulgaria. And uh, some of us tend to do that here. I don't I don't say everybody's here like this. But you know, ba Balkan people are a little bit more we are poorer, we are more evil and stuff like this. Stuff like this. <laughs> and stuff like this, stuff like this, stuff like this. It looks interesting, I would say. Maybe a little bit more stuff like this and we'll see. <laughs> By the way, I will have to make his neck thicker. Otherwise, from the side view, he doesn't look like a God of War. He looks like uh, something else, uh, not God of War. But now it's okay. Now we can say it's fine. Let's say what people say about me. You're going fast. If you have time left, can you make him wear a tutu? What is tutu? I'm not sure what is tutu, but probably I will not make him wear a tutu. This is a God of War. I, we have to have a little bit respect of the guy, you know? Uh, otherwise, you know, maybe a war will come to you, you know? You know, I, I would make the joke that Ukrainians uh, make fun probably of him and now, but it's uh, it's so cruel, it's not good. I mean, like, uh, to make jokes about 9-11, uh, just a little bit uh, after 9-11, it's not good. People will not take it very nicely. Although some uh, comedians in... In America, I think did it, uh, but they are brave. I'm not. I'm not brave. I'm a coward. A big fat coward. Although I'm not big. No, I'm big, but not fat. But coward. Uh, so yeah. Maybe I'm big, but not fat and coward. But coward eventually, yes. It would be nice to have a character one day to do a week separated into parts by lives. Then you can talk in more detail and make renders and other things. Yeah, but this will be like a course, uh, which... Uh, why should I do it? Do it for free. Ah, we have to be commercial, you know. Although, <laughs> obviously, uh, in my main channel I have a course, which is absolutely for free. And I did it, and it's like... Maybe 20, 24 hours of uh, videos recorded and everything, and it's absolutely for free. So maybe I'm not as commercial as I want to think I am, but still, yeah. But you know, it's also for commercial purposes. I will tell you why. If you give people something for free, which is a quality stuff, then they will buy your other stuff. For example, let's take Proco, for example. Proco, mo mostly you know probably Proco. Proko is a guy, he has more than a million subscribers, million and a half probably, in YouTube. Uh, and he has this amazing anatomy series. But just so nice. And he... Uh, and it's for free in YouTube, in his channel. And at some point, he made a paid version of this. But it's just... I have it. I have the paid version. And it's not... That much more content. I mean, it's a little bit more, a little bit more in depth, more stuff, but not that much more. So, yeah. But people are still buying it. Why? Because they appreciate the quality stuff that he gave them for free. Very, very good. I will start to make always the the, the arms like this. Before that, I, will, I was making them with uh, with curves, but, you know. Can you move the picture to another place, please? Because I want to see which case you are pressing. But you are seeing them just below the picture. 
you know, uh, you cannot mm, make everyone happy because some people say, uh, move it down because we can, we, we don't, we want to see the faces here. How much faces? Uh, the other people say we want to see the keys. You know? Yeah, I should find a way probably, but uh, you know, now is time for sculpting. And as I said, this is not as educational video. This is more like a fun video to show off my skills. <laughs> probably that's the reason I'm doing it. To show off, just to show off. Yeah, I'm too honest with you guys. I have to lie more. I, I'm i saying everything as it is. It's not good. People don't do that. I have to lie. You have to lie. You have to make yourself look cool and nice and stuff like this. Now, uh, my subscribers will... I mean, not my subscribers, but the, the active viewers of any of my streams will never pass like uh, 200. Because... I'm saying what's on my mind and it's not commercial. See you at Dev Play. Yes, definitely. I will speak a little bit there about myself. <laughs> it will be very much fun. I will speak so much about myself. It will be amazing. People will just hate it. I mean, yeah, some people will probably be mm, uh, interested in how I got here, what I was in the beginning, I will show probably one of my earliest 3Ds and stuff like this. But other than that, we'll see. Probably I will sculpt something also. Just something fast, a skull. Skull is always a good choice for fast sculpting or just a face, you know. Hi from Alger, uh, very nice. Do I need to have a ZBrush if I want to sculpt models professionally, like you see in AAA games? Yes. For most AAA games, which are like uh, God of War or uh, or whatever uh, else games you want to see, like uh, realistic ones, you need ZBrush. But also what you need is not only ZBrush. You need years and years of practice and skill. Otherwise, uh, it will not be possible. But other than that, yeah, ZBrush is the, the guy, so, yeah, not, not Blender, for the realistic ones. For just normal AA games, probably Blender is enough. Now we have two arms, suddenly. What is this? A magic? What's happening? How did he do that? But there was just one arm a second ago. Wow. Wow. This guy is a magician, probably. What's the Dynamesh of Blender? How is it called? It's called Remesh. And I'm doing it uh, constantly with Control R. The Dynamesh of Blender. It's the best. I mean, it's like the same as Dynamesh. I don't see it uh, any different than the normal Dynamesh, so... Yeah, you may say it's very similar to the Dynamesh. To the Dynamesh. Okay, let's see how... I, I have to concentrate a little bit on the fist here because it's not easy. I mean, to do a fist in this position, uh, I have to concentrate. So watch me concentrate now. <laughs> I have to concentrate a little bit less because I will fill my pants with uh, smelly concentration. Uh, yeah, it will not be very cool. So I have to concentrate a little bit less probably. This big concentration uh, leads to nothing good. Ah, maybe it will be just a fart, so it's not a big issue, but still it could be something else. We have to be aware of uh, the things that could happen. Yeah. How much time has passed? 25 minutes. So 25 minutes for this. Nah, it's not bad. I mean, we can do better, but uh, I'm not answer any of your questions almost. So I'm sorry about that. Sometimes uh, for this, if I want this to work, I have to be more concentrated on the sculpt itself, not on 
for questions. Nico, could you give me a tip on where to start studying? Assuming that I already know the software, where would I start with exercises? Start with exercises, uh, whatever you want to do. I mean, if you kind of like to do human heads, start doing human heads. If you like to do human butts, start doing those. But you have to uh, look for references, of course. Especially, many people probably want to start doing uh, female breasts and look for, for a lot of reference. I'm sure. I'm pretty sure that they uh, probably want to do that. Mm, so it's also a possibility. You can always start from that also. Female breasts also a possibility for sculpting. Uh, but always watch references and that's the key. That's the key. For female breasts too. Yeah, it's normal. For everything. What reference is the key. By the way, uh, making a fist is not an easy thing. If you think that ah, pff, making a fist is so easy, it's not that easy. But you will say, but Nico, you have made so many fists in your life. How can you say it's not easy? It's super easy for you. Uh, even for me, it's not super easy. It's kind of maybe easier than most, but still not the easiest ever. Uh, is, is this guy called Sean Olsen or how is it called? I mean, the guy who is making the cartoon stuff in ZBrush, this kind of uh, lives he's making like I'm making, but for ZBrush Central or for, I'm not sure, Sean Olsen, I think, or Sean, Sean somebody. Sure. But I think I'm faster than him, which is... And I'm working in Blender. So faster than him and working in Blender. What's happening here? Kratos has the same hairstyle like you. Yeah. <clears throat> I just don't uh, want to <clears throat> put a beard on. And my nose is... By the way, my nose is pretty good. I mean, I can do this and I will be a Kratos. With a beard and everything. It will be pretty possible. Pretty much possible. Let's see how we can do the knuckles here because he has to have some. Okay, now mm, the the hands will take a lot of time because I'm always not happy with the hands. I always like oh, we can do more, we can do better hands, and the hands are important because they always are visible and I mean not not they're always are visible but when they are visible people will watch them and say ah there is something wrong with these hands because everybody knows how hands looks like everybody has hands uh, I mean maybe not everybody has hands but most people have hands so yeah and for the head also most people have heads let's say everybody have heads yeah let's agree on everybody have head had head yeah head but uh, for the hands, not so much. Kratos has air, okay. Hands are filled are the hardest part for me. For me too, but uh, yeah, except for the face. The face is probably the hardest. Maybe we can make the arms a little bit like this. Okay, how does he look? Is he look cool already? Yeah, but uh, maybe the, the arms should be a little bit thicker. Because he's a cartoon, you know, and he's a Kratos God of War, so it's he has to be strong and big and huge and everything like this. I think he's working. He's working out <laughs> with the uh, dumbbells. I mean, he's now using the dumbbells and making some exercises, most likely. That's why he's so huge and pumped. But I will put an X on his arms. I just have to fix a little bit. By the way, now is the time to color him a little bit and you will see how Im immediately he will start to look a little bit more interesting with color. So, for the color, he's uh, gray. So, I will use a lighter tone of gray for his face and for his body. 
and for his arms. So, this is gray. Now, for the beard. Okay, the face a little bit more gray. Okay, for the beard, what kind of color? A little bit brownish color. Let's remove the, the concept for now. Brown. Darker. Not so. Okay. All right, beard man. Let's do this. Ah, it's too bright. Let's go here and go to the saturation and dial it down. Okay, select this color. Mm, select this color and go a little bit darker. All right, now it's fine. Okay, he's not that. Uh, he has to be whiter, probably. But um, hmm, we'll see. Yeah, but I can make him a little bit whiter. So with this uh, value, whiter, S, put here, color. Okay, the value whiter and whiter the value. It's amazing. Now, now it looks okay. Nico, I have a big problem. I can do my work good when somebody watch me or uh, sculpt on my own. Do a great, I do a great job. Ah, when you somebody watch you, you cannot do good. But uh, okay, it's normal. If you freelance by yourself, it's okay. If you are uh, a, a teacher like me, for example, it could be a problem. But if you're not, what's the problem? You know. I know many people who cannot sculpt while watched live for example but they are amazing sculptors when you when they are uh, alone <laughs> and they are making good money because you know they can do their work so it's fine can you make in the next time the green arrow please or over queen up uh, i'm not sure that uh, yeah if we have a nice concept but he's not that famous at least for me it's god of war is much more famous like wolverine is much more famous but if there is a nice, very nice concept. Could be done eventually. Now, let's see what we can do next. We don't have too much time to think, but we have to do the arms a little bit twisted and the the fist. Yeah, let me show you what I will do. Now, I will mask this area and smooth the mask a lot. Then I will smooth it even more by just dragging with the mask brush to smooth it. Now I wanna turn this a, this a little bit. So uh, mask, not mask, sculpt, set pivot to mask border. Okay, and then turn it a little bit like this. Okay, this should be enough. We'll see. And then what I will do, I will disable the mask, go here, L, P, selection. And now this is a different mesh. This one will go. Let me see. I will select this one. And move it like this. Okay. And this one. I will do something very interesting with it. Let me show you what it is. I will make a big selection again here with mask. Then I will smooth the mask. Then I will draw. Oops. Yeah, where's my mask? Okay, draw like this. And you will see this will become something of a huge abomination in just a few seconds. Wait for it. Wait for it. And amazing. Amazing. So, uh, and I will have to move, the, move this down a little bit. So, he's holding the axe. I think this could work. And now, you see what happened here. Huge abomination. But, it's not a big issue. Because we now can do this. Inflate. Inflate. Smooth. Inflate. Inflate. Smooth. Show only this. Inflate. Inflate. And then control R and then smooth. 
and of course a lot of smoothing will be required but we eventually will be able to have our arm nice and easy yeah you people are uh you know uh you are writing in the chat i'm not reading it it's amazing right it's so much fun it's a, a such a huge conversation <laughs> happening so cool yeah probably you will leave oh wow 200 and something people i never thought that we will reach this number but more than that will be difficult i mean probably the peak will be around 500 at some point and then everything will go to hell I don't need to put too much muscles because it's a stylized character so we have to be careful with those huge muscles that I'm trying to put and also um, we don't need to put too much muscles why? but why Nico? Uh, because this could be covered by his uh, you know, things or not, we'll see People are, uh, people are going down now because they don't see the whole picture and now they see the whole picture and they will start coming back again <laughs> it's amazing yeah yeah very cool ah yeah new record are you quit zbrush we miss you tutorials on it it was so helpful yeah but i gave the zbrush community what i could give and now you see people are like we are the ZBrush users, you are the Blender users. And the Blender users are, oh, those guys are using ZBrush, we are using Blender. We are all sculptures, you know. Uh, so, it's the same. I mean, we are sculpting, so it's not that, oh, those guys or those guys. We are the same. So, I haven't left the community of sculptors. I have left the community of ZBrush, which is completely fine, you know. It could happen to anyone. <laughs> now, let me show you. Cylinder. Uh, I need a little bit more faces on this cylinder. So let's try 30. Maybe too much, but let's see. Now, this cylinder. What will happen with it? You will see. I will delete the top and the bottom. X faces. Now I will take this one and put it here. Scale it. Make it smaller. And this will be his belt, for example. Why not? Huh? Belt. Amazing. Yes. Okay, this is the belt. All right, now, after the belt, we will duplicate this, Shift D, move it up, P, selection, so it's an, another selection, and this will be his, the thing on his, uh, you know, chest. The chest belt, we may say. And now I will make it with the sculpting brushes. I love to do it with the sculpting brushes, by the way, to do those things. So that's why, that's what I will do now. I cannot see it at all. It's very bad. Okay, let's see it like this. Oh, ooh. Okay. I'll just move it around a little bit. And then let's see everything. Uh, in the back, I don't care. I mean, it will not be visible, so it's fine. I will just make it until this point. Around this point, it will be fine. Yeah, you will see. It should work. I've done it already once, so it should work. Of course, uh, what I'm doing here is not always the best option if you're doing something for production. Um, you have to be a little bit slower and you have to do the things properly. This could be the proper way sometimes, but most of the time probably it will not be. This is the fastest way, more like uh, put things here, here, fast, 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 but not the proper way maybe. So be careful. Please, a less muscular and skinny character next. Ah, huh. Spider-Man. So you want Spider-Man. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it will be difficult. Uh, too much detail on this guy. For the costume. Uh, and he will not look at as Spider-Man if he doesn't have the costume, I think. So, yeah, I don't know. How much time do we have? Oh, pff, we have like almost an hour left. So we probably will be able to do it, which is great. It's pretty cool.
Now this, we press A, Shift D, right click, scale it down a little bit, scale it like this. And I don't know what happened with the other one. So I will just, you know, go like this, press A, and then scale it down. Now it's okay, scale it up, it's, it's perfect. Now, this is the outer thing. Now let's do a, a cylinder, and this will be our X. 16 of the cylinder faces will be fine. Three, oops, select this, select this, X faces, and no, we don't want to delete those. Okay, now press A and make it big, make it small, make it big. I think this big will be fine for the X handle. Maybe a little bit longer. All right, now put it in his hand, hands, hands, and then I will adjust his hands to the X or the X to, to his hands. We'll see what will be exactly what I do. Something like this will be cool. Yeah, from this uh, position, it looks relatively fine. Okay, ah, it's, it's, it's working. Or we can make Batman or Spider-Man or Captain America with this shield, it will be nice. Yeah, yeah, probably yes. But Batman will be easier. You're the Bob Ross of digital sculpting. Yeah, I know. You know, Bob Ross. It's me. It's me, basically, I'm Bob Ross. I just shaved my head. Very informative and very relaxing technical. Thank you very much. So I catch your stream, still remember we were starting Blender and struggling with the commands in Blender in your other channel. <laughs> but now not. <laughs> I see this daily before sleep to have a good dreams. Thank you. Really, you have a good dreams with this face? With this face? Really? Strange people live around the world, I may say. Or you can make Batman or Spider. Okay, yes. Would you say that the final product you are making now would be able to be used for 3D printing? No. It has to be. It will be able to be used for 3D printing, definitely. But with uh, a lot of modifications we may say not just like that you know uh, with like five more hours if i put on it it will be nice for 3d printing and probably i will if people are interested if they want to give me their money i will put it on sale for example in uh, for 3d printing in um just a bust just until here in where in sketchfab why not because in Sketchfab, nothing sells, you know. It's very rarely I sell something in Sketchfab. Some of my models. I have the orc with the big guns, the model for sale there. Uh, I think they bought it once. And who bought it was the AliExpress guys who are now selling the figure on AliExpress. So, yeah. I have also the print version of uh, Freddy Mercury. On my station you can see it by the way now in this video in the description you can see everything the art station some of the courses uh the discord channel i don't think i put the i don't know if i put I, if i have put the the uh the facebook the facebook group hopefully i did but it's not as important it just PHR character courses or whatever it's called, I'm not sure. The character group. I already don't know how my group is called. Uh, yeah, I'm so old. I mean, I'm 40 years old, it's not that much, but I feel like I'm like 60 or 70. I'm so wise, that's why, you know. At least 70 years old, I feel like. Especially with my, with my back problems these days, and I'm walking like at least 70 75 year old guy nico you should try to be kratos in real life you look like him a bit in his younger days <laughs> i'm the young i'm the young kratos yeah yeah i'm not uh, so much into cosplay though uh, so yeah probably i would be kind of like kratos but not so good now uh let's wrap this no we we have a lot more to do but let's do the axe so uh i always start with a plane 
be careful now uh, listen carefully now 90 degrees rotation of the plane put it uh, above his head here uh, control a oops control a to uh, apply all transformations then tab and now we are starting to scale it down let's see the x okay now from here uh, i want to go through this position go closer maybe press home and then go closer and then extrude extrude move this up extrude 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 i don't know what i'm saying these things but i'm uh, used to say everything i do in my courses that's why you will forgive me that i'm talking what i'm doing exactly although you can always uh, obviously see what i'm doing but it's just uh the teachers have to do this you have to uh, spell everything that you do like i'm extruding extruding a little bit here extruding a little bit there control r just to put one more edge loop and then move this here and this here and then we have a decent edge decent not edge but something decent we have let's say we have something decent oops just two and move them like this uh, how about me to challenge for you uh, your followers challenges maybe some uh, at some point i will start uh, putting challenges on my discord channel but for now i don't feel that i'm th that famous or that uh, good or whatever you know so yeah someday i will start uh, challenges with like the pub lander the pablo nunos gomez yeah, I always uh, uh, talk about this guy in my streams. I don't know why. Because I like him. Maybe if you ask me who is my one of my favorite artists, and he probably is one of them. Although, for anatomy... <laughs> but he's very good at some things, so I like him. And he once said hi to me. So, yeah, I like him. <laughs> yeah, you know the small things, little things. Mirror, move it, clip it, select the outer edges. There is a way to select the outer edges, by the way, um, automatically, if your model is a little bit more. Uh, but uh, it's somewhere in the menu, so I'm not sure exactly where. So, you know. so I extruded the edges inward. Now I will select only those uh, which I need to sharpen the X, the front and the back. And you see, this is very easy to make this kind of X. It's like eh, two and two, four, no problem. Eh, it is good. Now I will select some edges here on this stage, yeah, and here, and probably here, and this, and maybe here, and here. And oops. Yeah, it will be difficult by the way because I have to select also those thin edges in here, which will take time. But if we want this axe to be a little bit more uh, smooth, we need to do this. We need to do this. So, Shift E, but first add the subdivision surface modifier. I increase the subdivisions to like let's say three and then shift e and move it until we got like 0 0.5 should be fine and we have a nice uh thing apply the mirror modifier apply no i will not apply the subdivision surface for now i don't need to apply it now what i need to do is let me see if this is turned yes so press a alt alt n flip now it's good mm, what else Aha, okay let me see now i will take this no okay and then just inflate it like this okay how does it look i think it looks fantastic passed my test to watch the stream nico fridays fridays he's very technical in zibosh pablo yeah pablo is very technical in zibosh and he's good. We all know that he's good. 
he's better than yours truly, but whatever. So why are you watching me? Go watch Pablo. I'm joking, watch me. Uh, today we can pass, because it's a god of war, you know, we can pass uh, 300 subscri uh, pff, viewers. <laughs> Subscribers, we have passed already a, a lot more, but, you know. Oh, okay, I will rotate it. So from the front, it's a little bit more visible. I just need to fit it in a little bit better. It's not exactly where I want it to be. But you see, for this amount of time, we have to be a little bit less picky. Because otherwise, nothing will happen. I will inflate this area a little bit. Okay, select this, rotate it so it's it's more interesting. I have to adjust the things. Now it looks relatively fine. Uh, let's continue working on his uniform a bit. Uh, okay. Okay, uh, I will just uh, take a little time and answer some of the questions. Are you switching to mouse in object mode and to pen tablet when sculpting? Yes, most of the time I do that. How many blue t-shirts do you have? I have three of them now, but I will buy more. I need to go, man. I really like to watch you doing it. Keep uh, this up. Yeah, thank you. Hello from Brazil. Hello, Brazil. Hello, uh, uh, United States. Hello, everybody from Russia, from Brazil, from uh, UK, from Canada, from France, from Italy, from even uh, Israel. But uh, the Israel, I think, will go. So, yeah. He, he told me that he will leave now. So, yeah. Uh, how many will this show? Okay. Hey, Nikon. I'm not Nikon. I'm not Sony. I'm not uh, even uh, other type of camera. But whatever. Could you give some tips for the side profile of the face? Yeah, you have to do the side profile of the face uh, sometimes. If you don't do it, probably your sculpt will look bad. So, yeah. I think good tip, yeah. Right. right. Yeah, probably in my head anatomy, I will do it. Uh, yeah. Your streams have a lot more viewers when you are sculpting something from an established franchise. I guess you're right. What do you suggest practicing more of sculpting new and different characters, all finalizing till the end? Uh, what? To suggest practicing more sculpting new different... Ah, for me, new different characters is the best. I don't, uh, you know, I don't finish anything these days. <laughs> Only on my courses I kind of make finished characters. Other than that, I'm just practicing. And for practicing, I don't finish anything. I just do, do, do a lot. For, for example, today I did um, two or three heads and this guy just for practice. Uh, and this was only for like three hours or four hours, something like this. So, yeah, I'm not working too much, but uh, I'm doing a lot of stuff because I can. Shift D, move this here, P, selection, and then select it. Um, and rotate it like this, scale it a little bit maybe, and then in sculpt mode I can move it. Of course this one has to be a little bit bigger probably, so it can touch there. This one should go like that, and we are golden. We are golden, golden, but my eyes can't see. Silence is golden, golden. Yeah, I listen to that kind of music also. Just a relaxing music, something, you know. I don't like this. There is something wrong with this. It's too big or something. Yeah. And for that thing, to uh, establish what is wrong, um, there could be a lot of time. Uh, I mean, yeah. But... Eh, what to do now let's do solidify modifier we like that increase the thickness go to edge data increase the thickness too maybe the rim too a little bit and then uh, subdivision surface two times and it looks good now let's select this and this and this and this and this and the final one should be this control l uh, link uh, object data i think no copy modifiers yes okay it's cool all right, see, uh, Blender is not that bad for sculpting, I guess. Hello from East Timor. 
Really? East Timor? Where was this? In Asia somewhere? I'm not sure. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a little bit not so familiar with East Timor. My bad. I'm not sure where is it really. What's wrong with Israel? Absolutely nothing. Just the guy from Israel who was here, he told me that he has to go. And that's why I said that Israel is not in the chat. Maybe there's other people in the uh, from Israel in the chat, but who knows? Because nobody says anything. Or at least I'm not reading. You didn't say Mexico on sub. Sorry. I didn't say a lot of uh, countries, by the way. <laughs> I didn't say India, for example, although there are a lot of people from India. And I, I didn't say Turkey, although there are a lot of people from Turkey. I didn't say Serbia. Uh, I'm not sure if there are a lot of people from Serbia, though. But still, I didn't say Romania, although I'm sure there are people from there. So I cannot say everything, maybe. So unsub, if you have to, no problem. It's okay. Why don't you texture your work? Ah, it's too much, uh, too much time. Too much time will take to test texture it. So, not a good idea. Uh, for the stream, I mean. And for the other works, I don't texture it because uh, I have to go to Substance Painter because I'm not good at, in texturing in other programs. That's the problem, you know. That's the big issue, we may say. Okay, this will be one. Uh, it has to be a little bit more black. So let's make the value a little bit darker. Yeah, but not so dark. Okay, like, like this will be fine. Then I will select this color and draw it over the other guys. Just on the front. Because we don't have time. Not so much on the back. But it's it's fine. It looks relatively fine. We we will adjust a little bit the face. We will adjust a little bit so, so some things. But for now, it looks relatively good. You didn't say California either. <laughs> so California is another country <laughs> right now. California separating from United States? Really? Oh, I didn't know that. You have to be in the United States. It's okay. I'll be back. Huh? Your governor. Uh, your former governor, I think. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't know too much uh, about United States. Although, I probably know mo more than some of its residents. But uh, it's okay. Because I'm curious. You haven't said Spain. Really? I missed Spain. What a mistake of my side. I mean, I missed Bulgaria too. <laughs> which is my country. Ah, so yeah. People will start unsubscribing right now. Like very quick unsubscribe. Oh, this guy doesn't mention my country. He doesn't mention Nigeria. So unsubscribe. What is he, this guy thinking? He doesn't mention this and that. Unsubscribe. Now, let's make a little bit of this on his arm here. So cylinder. Again, everything is from cylinder as you can see. X, faces. Delete those. X, faces. A. Shift, Alt, Z. And then move it with G. Move it here. Place it. I haven't trained for that particular part. But hopefully I will be able to do it. Relatively fine. So this we need. A few more pieces of this. But we will adjust this one. And. Maybe with two. Pieces like this will be. Okay. So there are a lot of uh, people who are offended. That I don't, didn't mention their country. Oh, you didn't mention Tibet? You bastard. Why didn't you mention Tibet? What's happening? What's wrong with you? You didn't mention Singapore. We didn't mention... You didn't mention Zanzibar. 
Although I went to Zanzibar once. It was cool. Yeah, Zanzibar. Uh, uh, nice, nice. But I went. I, I was to. Uh, I was in Spain. I was in Cordoba. I was in um, Malaga uh, and stuff like so. I may not mention Spain, but I was there. So, you know, I visited for like two weeks. We rented a car and we went around the uh, uh, South Spain, mostly. Uh, it was pretty cool. Press A. Shift D. Move it back. Oh, okay. P. Selection. Select it. Go. Sculpt mode. We have to be very fast because we are approaching... Oh, we are one hour into the sculpt already. Ah. Ah, we have a nice uh, thing going on. So, in half an hour, probably I will be able to finish something. Uh, not to finish it, but just to make it a little bit more finished, let's say. Let's take this. No, this, this, and this. Uh, control L and l copy modifiers and then we will color it okay let's select it first and then color it because if we don't select it oh no 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 please no yeah and definitely before we finish this we have to make this uh, his red things otherwise it will be unfinished of course what kind of stream I'm doing? I'm just speaking. I'm not... Oh, Nig Nigerian, really? Debo Adekale, Nigerian. Huh, very nice. I wasn't expecting that. Hello, do you separate fingers? Uh, no, no, no. For the fist, no. Uh, no, my cat is okay. Uh, you did not mention Area 51. <laughs> yeah, it's a separate country. Mars, wow. You didn't mention Belize. How dare you? Yeah, we need another session with you reciting all the country names. I can, of course. I will find the list and I will just read it. His head is pretty small. Yeah, I know, I know. But uh, no, it's pretty big. I mean, I have a short, uh, you know, thin neck and big head. So it's not very small. Uh, if you're talking about the model, you, which you probably are, but um, his head is absolutely good because he's the god of war he has to be strong so even i can make it smaller but i won't i, I don't want to tease people i mean if people think that the head is too too small and i make it smaller then it's a little bit of a teasing right it's like ha you know like making fun of them which nobody likes that or some people may like that. Who knows? I probably would not appreciate it. We have to respect each other. You know, I always say that. Respect is everything. If you don't respect me, it will be difficult for me to respect you. And the other way around. If I don't respect you, it will be difficult for you to respect me. By the way, I will not make anything for this hand here. Um, I will probably make the body a little bit more polygonal with more polygons just sharpen some areas inflate some areas like the chest why not maybe i will do a little bit of non-symmetry modifying here to push this in just to look more interesting although it will look more Realistic, which is not exactly what I'm aiming at. But, okay. More detail in here. More detail in this area, maybe. Although it's not visible in the concept, but it should be. Do he have... Does he have nipples? Probably he has. Now he has, so it's okay. God of War, man. Now, uh, I need a little bit more detail on this part here. Um, no, I will not be able to make all this detail, I'm sorry. But I will put something there. What kind of detail I can put there? Let's see, this kind of a metal plate in here, why not? How to do it? Let's press tab, let's select uh, this. 
through here shift D scale it uh, I will separate it and then scale it and then I will color it uh, gray and it will be the metal part very fast furious and everything as it is as it should be yeah because we cannot make uh, everything as you can see by the way can I make this kind of a thing around no I cannot <laughs> it will be too much time we cannot do it for this amount of time we have we have to concentrate a little bit more on the face probably although here the belt can we do something for the belt let's select those this until here shift d move it forward and then p selection and then uh, select it and just just a little detail because it's too much undetailed here okay color it all right looks better now let's concentrate on the face because it's a little bit unfinished we need to make it look great let's first read something Ah, uh, Haizuzu Nico confirms he switched to pen tablet not display when he, in sculpt mode and in object mode when he uses his computer mouse yes uh, please do a skinny character for tomorrow when rib cages and backbone is visible from skin hmm interesting a zombie you know also which GPU and CPU he has. Yes, I know what uh, GPU and CPU I have. I have uh, a good CPU and GPU. <laughs> no, my GPU is uh, 2080 and my CPU is a Ryzen 3950X or something like this. 16 cores Ryzen from uh, like 3 years ago or something. Or two years ago, I'm not sure already. A little bit of ice. Ice, ice, baby. Uh, for the nose, I will start doing it asymmetri asymmetrically. It will be broken. I'm broken. Yeah, I listened to Pantera, by the way, if somebody knows. Not these days, when I was younger. Nowadays, it's a little bit too much, but sometimes I just put it on just for the sake of the old days, you know. I'm broken, like the nose of uh, God of War. <laughs> All right. That's Maya. No, that's Kratos. Maya uh, is for some other stream. This is Kratos here. Don't don't mistake. It's it's not. It can, how can it be Maya, since it's a male? Obviously, it's not a female. It's a male, so it's not Maya. No, couldn't be. And if you ask about the software, it's Blender. But uh, yeah, I just had to make fun. Of Maya. Maya, uh, obviously, I saw somewhere that Maya have a sculpting kind of a mode or something. I'm not sure. It's interesting. Cinema 4D also probably has something like this. 3D Max also, I think, have uh, has something similar. But of course, they cannot measure with the master. Blender because you know from the real 3d programs blender is eh, Obviously the best uh, From the not real 3d programs ZBrush is the best Yeah, so now it's settled Fucking hostile. Oh, I said fucking I, I shouldn't say that in YouTube. I think Fuck, okay, no problem you know, uh, to say fuck, uh, I mean, to say this word, the F word, so many times, uh, just uh, to 
I don't know, to look interesting or something, it's it's not good. So don't do this, kids. Don't do this at home. D don't do this even out of your home. Don't do this ever. Maybe do it only when you're alone and nobody can hear you in the forest or something. You can say this word uh, as much as you can, but uh, it's not good. Cursing is not a symbol of uh, manlyhood or something. Although we do it. I do the cursing, by the way, mostly when I'm driving uh, in the city. I do a lot of cursing when I'm driving in the city. See, Nico is a very good guy, but he's cursing when he's driving. Oh, <gasps> This guy, he's not good. He's the devil in disguise. Hello, Nico. Hello, Nope. 3D Max sucks. Worst program ever. Yes, I agree. As in ZBrush, it's the best at subdomain. It does. Yes. The F word, forest. Forest, yes. Fire, yes. Fuck, no. So be careful. There are yes and no's, which we can do. I didn't know you were a taxi driver also. No, no, just an Uber driver sometimes. No, I've never been an Uber driver, but someday, why not? Just for fun. Who knows? Who knows what uh, the world can offer to a guy? If I'm too bored, I can do this. It will be fun. Imagine going to Sofia and you call an Uber and it's me, you know. And you say, hmm, I've seen your face somewhere. Maybe in YouTube or I don't know. Said, ah, no. Hey Nico, greetings from Norway, Oslo. Yeah, first thing I hear is the F word. This is going to be a fun, fun stream. Yeah, we all say it. Yeah, we all say it. Even if English is not our main language, uh, for me, it's not my la uh, main language, the English. But still, I say the F word. Why? I don't know. Maybe the American movies are too much for us. You know, when I grew up, it was the Conan the Barbarian. It was uh, a lot of uh, movies which was which were very cool. But I remember Conan because uh, it was one of my first movie experience uh, in the theater. I mean, in the cinema. Conan the Barbarian. It was like 80... Mm, uh, I mean, Conan the Barbarian was... They uh, put it in the cinemas in here in Bulgaria because we were in the communist time. Uh, several years after the release of the movie. So it was... 87, 88 probably when I watched it. I'm not exactly super sure what, when it was, but it was one of my first movies in the cinema and uh, I was super impressed. And still it's a very nice movie, uh, back to these days. I have watched it like several times uh, in the last years and I still like it. But you know, Oliver Stone I think is the director or... Uh, the producer, I'm not sure. So it should be a good movie, right? Hi there, Brazil here. You said of one of the tutorials that you came here once. Yeah, I was in Brazil. I was in uh, Rio de Janeiro and in Iguazu, Iguazu Waterfalls. And that was it. That was my experience from Brazil. It was pretty cool, by the way. We slept in the favela just above uh, Copacabana beach. Very cool. The view was amazing. And it was a little bit scary, maybe, but you know, I'm from Bulgaria. And uh, you know, Brazil, people say it's uh, scary, it's, uh, but you know, when you are from the Balkans, ah, it's okay. It's not a problem. Back when I was there, the favelas, especially those favelas, more central ones, were pretty specified. 
pacified, pacified, yeah. they were peaceful, no problems there. Although some people were kind of talking to us and trying to make us go somewhere to kill us, but other than that, it was pretty cool. Yeah, it was a nice experience most of the time. All right. The face is the most important part, that's why I'm paying more attention to it now. No symmetry, okay, it's fine. We don't need this symmetry anymore, I think. It's not Christian stream, uh, definitely it's not. I'm sorry about the, the Christian people, I'm sorry about the, all the religious people, I'm sorry about the Adventists of the Seventh Day, I, I don't know how it's called exactly in the... Um, and why I'm telling uh, precisely about the Adventists of the Seventh Day, you will ask. But Nico, why do you precisely say about them? Because once I was in uh, their church, not once, I was in their church a few times. And I was singing songs with them. And I was having fun with them. Because they were amazing young people. Um, very nice. And uh, it was it was so much fun. They were not drinking alcohol. They were not cursing. They were very intelligent people, by the way. I was amazed by this uh, people from this church. Probably not everywhere it's like this, but uh, where I was, it was. It was good. And uh, yeah, it's just uh, we have this uh, very big thing that we don't have in common, that they believe in God, and I kind of don't. So. Yeah, you may say I'm an atheist, but I'm not sure what I am. I just don't quite believe in God. And you will ask, but Nico, what do you believe in? I believe in people, I believe in uh, family, I believe in love. Yeah, in God, not so much. But you will say, but God is love. Yeah, if you say God is love, I believe in God. Yes, if God is love, I believe in Him his her whatever what is god is it her is it him uh -huh. nobody knows but people from uh, the old world i mean the sexist people from the old uh, where the society was more men you know men, men said uh, god is man you know nowadays god can be everything because we are more equal now right so uh, it shouldn't be only men although in uh, in ancient greece there were a lot of goddesses but in christian world there is only one god and that's it and he is a male but you know what is the difference between one christian people one christian guy and me how the ricky gervais said it i think he was no maybe it was not him but uh, whatever uh, what is the difference? He believes in... I don't believe in 3,000 gods, let's say. Because there are around 3,000 or 10,000 gods in the world. There was, there were. So I don't believe in all of them. In all, like, let's say 3,000 gods. I don't believe in them. The Christian guy don't believe in one less god than me. So we are pretty similar, right? I guess we are kind of the same. So we are all atheists. But some people believe in just, you know, one less God. No, they believe in one more <laughs> one God, uh, but don't believe in one less than me. Why am I talking about this? What's happening here? I'm doing a, ah, I'm doing a God of War, that's why I'm talking about gods. Do I believe in God of War, you will ask, probably. Um, yes, why not? He's making a lot of money for the people who made the game. And, uh, yeah, it's cool. Maybe they should make a movie about it. About it for the game. I mean, uh, those kind of games usually get movies made. So probably they will kind of take the idea seriously and do it at some point, I guess.
All right, let's continue with these eyes because I'm not completely sure how they should be. By the way, I will make a little bit. Let's see your comments on this. God is just a sculptor. <laughs> Probably. Hello from Turkey. You're so good, man. Teşekkürler. Teşekkürler, arkadaş. Cheers from Brazil. Great content. Thanks for sharing. Thank you also. Nico believes in Chrome. <laughs> of course. God is money. Not to sound like. Yeah, God of War. Three core gods in India. Ah, you have three core gods in India. Okay. So you believe in three. You don't believe in three less gods than I. You know, you believe like in, uh, let's say, you don't believe in 2,997 gods, and I don't believe in 3,000 gods. So, yeah, it's the same. <laughs> in Christianity, the Bible not notified there were smaller gods, but the god above is, yeah, so probably a big male god and few small female gods. Uh, sexist. It's, I mean, uh, nobody noticed that, but it's sexist. Why God is not, for example, uh, I will not say it. <laughs> I will not say it. Uh, let's, let's not go there. I'm happy to catch your life. Thank you. I just completed God of War. It's a masterpiece. Yeah, probably. Yeah. I haven't. I just, I don't, I don't know. I probably should. If you concept it's already real in some sense, yeah. Nico kind of a Zen person. Ah. Does it make uh, sense to use both ZBrush and Blender or just Blender these days? It makes sense to use everything you want and everything you need to finish your job. It doesn't matter if it's uh, ZBrush only or ZBrush and Blender or Blender and ZBrush or whatever, whatever. It just, you have to do your job properly. If you can, you are fine. If you can't, uh, you should try more. How much time do we have? Oh, we don't have too much time left. We have to make the red stripes on his skin. And we will be kind of fine. Yeah, I will make a little magic here. You will see. Magic, magic. Uh, magic. Okay. This was just a little magic. Nobody saw what I did, so it's fine. And now he looks a little bit better. And now let's make the red things. And you are, but Nico, what was this magic that you do? Why are you doing this? Why don't you show us? You bastard. You're doing things and don't show us. You are like all the rest, all the other guys. I think you were different. But you're not, Nico. Unsubscribe. Yes. Uh, thanks for the stream, heading away, thank you, thank you very much. Thanks for the answer. The head is kind of small compared with the concept, but it looks cool either way. Yeah, probably. Blender is the best style of stuff, so no much for realistic. Yes, everybody can think of it what they want. But, I will tell you what's the truth. Blender is the best, and it will be forever. <gasps> but Nico... You doing this? I'm joking. Zibush is the best. Okay, which one is the best? Say it already. What are you doing? Nothing is the best. You just have to. Just whatever you want, you know. It's your choice. For the beginners, I recommend Blender. Uh, because Blender, you have to know either way. Even if you know Zibush. You have to know Blender for, for the hard, hard surface stuff. Uh, for example, for the low poly, for the UVs, and to fix some things for the nice render or whatever, Blender is the best. <laughs> it's not the best, but it's uh, completely okay. So, please, use Blender. Buy my courses. Give me money, give me money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's uh, the whole idea of uh, everything, you know. Money, money, money to them. Always funny to them. But Nico, I didn't thought you are uh, this kind of very commercial person. Why are you doing this? I have to eat. <laughs> so much fun. So much fun to do these streams, guys. 
it's so much fun. I can speak whatever I want uh, until somebody bans me from YouTube, probably. But uh, until then, I am okay. Thank you very much. Let's see what this will look like. Uh huh. Okay. Watch from the start. They went by fast. How it's time for some else? Okay. Nico is the best. Oh, Mihai, you're here. Guys, Mihai, uh, Mihai Daranga is a, a Romanian sculptor. And uh, if you haven't seen his art, he's very good. He's amazing. His anatomy is uh, one of the best I've seen. It's very, very cool. And he's watching the stream right now. Very, very nice. He is also an archer. I saw his Facebook. Yeah. Uh, where can you find the courses, Nico? In the description of this video, you can find some of the links of, uh, to some of my courses. And by the way, some people are saying, why don't you uh, make donations possible in, in uh, YouTube? You know, if you want to donate, you can always go to our station and buy one of my courses, even if you don't need it. Just like donation, no. In our station, I got most of the money from the courses. So, it's completely fine. I will allow you to do it. If you want. But if you don't want, it's okay. I will not make you. It's fine. Either way, I'm selling uh, kind of okay. So, I don't care. But I will be thankful, probably. Or not. I don't know. Sometimes at the end of those super fast sculpts, I don't know who I am anymore, you know. It's uh, it's frustrating a bit. But now with the red things and with everything, he is looking uh, better. By the way, for the axe, we need to make the handle a little bit better. So control R, uh, make this with the screw wheel, put it here and then uh, maybe subdivision. Okay. Uh, it doesn't look very good, but I will fix it. I to insert, inset, not insert, inset. And here I will insert two with I. By the way, it's a little bit broken this, ah, but whatever, it's, uh, it's not so much problematic thing, you know. And I don't want to make it as curvy as the concept, so but I will make it a little bit curvy. Let's try. And thicker. I will inflate it. Because it was too thin. He's a strong guy, a big guy, and this thin axe was, was like, what's happening here? Why is this so thin? Has to be thicker. Much thicker. Next you can make James Hetfield or Kirk Hammett. By the way, I want to shout out to uh, uh, Mr. Mihai Daranga and let me just show it to you what he does. In our station. Here he is. This is his stuff. And I forgive him that he's copying me a little bit with this guy. <laughs> But he, he said that he's uh, doing that. Uh, we talked about it, so it's fine. Very good. Amazing style. I mean, um, let me see. I'm super inspired by those guys. I don't know why. They're just sketches, but they're very nice. The pose is very cool, like relaxed and just the the pelvis forward and everything. It's very cool. And with the, with the clavicles pointing like sharp, uh, with especially this guy here. Even without arms, without hands, he looks very cool. <laughs> See? Very nice. Ah, you know, we can infer, in, uh, find inspiration in other artists. It's not wrong, of course. See, amazing monsters and stuff. Very, very nice. You can subscribe, uh, you can follow him here in our station. He's very good. All right, what are we doing? Where are we? Oh. Can you show us your workroom sometime? 
Ah, uh, it's not the workroom. This is uh, the room when my where my kids play and everything. And now it's not very watchable. It's not very good to watch it. Okay. Uh, hey, Nico, is it wise to paint a model before retopology? Yes, because uh, you can paint it, then retopologize, and then you can bake the topology, uh, the the poly paint in some program like Substance Painter, for example, and make it as a texture, which is how I do it. Now again, I cannot select the belt. Amazing! Oh, I did it! I did it! Okay, I want to just make a little bit more uh, detail here by just uh, Shift D, move this P selection and this is just a separate object now which is great and it's giving us a, just a little bit more interesting thing going on here how much time do we have okay we have like maybe 20 minutes more until the two hours mark so we can do a little bit more what i don't know this looks a little bit empty here you know all this kind of big areas where nothing happens and they're empty i don't like but yeah let's go to poly paint and just poly paint the axe some color the handle of the axe this color i don't like because it's too bright set it <laughs> nico blue shirt what's up talk to the shirt you know <laughs> the shirt do you mind checking out my R station, Fred Studart? Let's check it out. Why not? We cannot check every guy's R station, of course. Fred Studart, yeah, it's here. Wow. Very good, I would say. Only 100 followers. It's not fair. It's not fair at all. I'd say pretty good stuff. Yes, let's see uh, this Red Hulk. Not bad at all, not bad at all. I can even follow your back. This is also good, B very good. Yeah, I would say you're pretty underestimated, under, under, the under. I forgot the name, uh, the word. <laughs> Hi teacher, all my female heads look bad. Do you know how I can fix them? With a lot of practice, you don't have anything else. You cannot do it, uh, you know, any other way. Just with a lot of practice with uh, references, like I do. Like references like this. Today I did this head, for example. It didn't happen exactly like this one, but I also did, uh, let me see which one I did. I think I did this one, yes, also today, just for practice. Just uh, for the planes of the head, you always need a little bit more practice. We have also other references here. We have skulls, we have everything. And by the way, uh, uh, before you say, Nico, can you give us this PDF file? It will be probably in the project files for my next course, so just, Relax for now. Underrated, yes, underrated. Everybody said underrated. Nico, I'm struggling to do a mouth. Any tip? Yeah, do a lot of mouths. It will be good. Uh, my second favorite teacher is Abraham. Cheers. Abraham from uh, the Facebook group uh, Zebrush something. I'm not sure. Ah, Grant is not a character artist. He's a, just a blender artist, yes. He cannot do characters. His characters are... <laughs> you know, for a character artist, they look pretty awkward. You know, if I have to judge them... I prefer not to judge them because it will be cruel. But he's a good blender artist, so I guess it's fine. It's good for him, so... Subdivision, apply. Let's apply a kind of a darker color for this guy. 
Where are we? Where is the concept now? I lost it. I lost the concept. Ah, it's here. <laughs> okay, for the for the X, we can select one kind of a darker gray color, and select one kind of a whitish color. We are doing just basic things here because we don't have time, and we have to just be fast, and that's why we are doing basics. By the way. Uh, yeah, it's fine. I mean, it's cool. He looks relatively cool. What else we can do? Nothing. We don't have time. <laughs> Nico, do you know the artist Marco Plouffe? Probably I heard of him. And is he there uh, any for the future Mega Organic Character course? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Nico Merhaba. Merhaba Nasselson. I agree. Is it wiser to focus on a sculpture and get it right? Or just make loads of yeah I already answered this question I think I think loads of sculptures is better you are the guru for self learner ah, pff, it's okay <laughs> self learner uh, most of the guys that I know are self learners learners because when you uh, kind of find something very nice to do you just want to do it and do it and all over and again and again and again and at some point you become very good at it and you're like oh i become very good at it what happened you don't realize it even how you become good in this thing right what can we do more yeah uh, I think it's fine. I mean, uh, we get the we got the silhouette, which is the most important thing. The overall silhouette it looks relatively fine, and the rest is just uh, you know a question of just working. And we don't have time for the rest, so it's fine. I just want to fix this, by the way. Solidify modifier apply. Mm, this no, and now I will make a little bit of this shift e and just to be sharper i need it to be sharper yeah and put it a little bit more inside so it looks like this and maybe i will do very quickly some spheres a little bit low quality spheres i want yes and then i will put them in some positions and we said but why do you need the spheres yoni uh yoni <laughs> uh, nico nico why do you need the spheres Yoni is my uh, daughter and I speak to her in English and that's why I made this awkward mistake. But uh, what I want to do from this sphere is to smash it, move it into position and just put it like, like a little bit of detail here and there. I think I will be pretty fast with this so it will not gonna hurt. It's not gonna be as the concept but it's gonna be okay. In the concept, they are smaller, those, uh, you know, things. I'm making them bigger, but I think it's fine. L, Shift D, move here, move it down, just put it into position. And it's getting boring, I'm sure, for all of you. So, uh... Whoever is bored can always go home. <laughs> or if you are home, uh, you can leave the stream as people are doing now because we are below 2,000 people now. 200, 200, not 2,000. Mistake. Doesn't look very nice. Doesn't look ultra cool. Maybe those really have to be smaller. So let's let's try something. Let's select this one, this one, control I, and then shift S to make them smaller, but with the mouse, because with the tablet it's a little bit, so shift S, alt S, I mean, alt S, make them smaller. All right, and then uh, some of them has to go a little bit more up, okay, to be more visible. Now it's better. I'm thinking it's better. 
and now I want this color so I will go select select this color select those and just make them a little bit darker and they should work all right uh, we should make this in another places but yeah for now it's fine let's make one more thing probably and we will finish this uh, madness this uh, agony and let's do this so select from here to here shift d p selection which is which is to uh, make it another object and then i will select the top move it down and the bottom move it up and this will be just a tiny bit more detail because we are lacking detail a lot it's not good to make a model without any detail like i did it's not fair to the concept guy but you know i'm not always fair to the concept guys because i'm doing very fast things and they mostly don't have the detail needed uh, but i think people can see and uh, i hope you have fun with this uh one more thing <laughs> i will do i'm sorry uh, i just have to mesh plane then i will rotate this uh, in edit mode like this 90 degrees move it here move it here and what i will do now is i don't know but i will try something so control r put one here put one in come on okay with the mouse will be better and increase it now one in the middle x faces and now with g i will move those and i will make something ah oh, we need more one here one in here and then i'll just try this 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 and this uh yeah it's uh not very nice let's go to scope of edit mode again press a s okay alt s alt s is not working very good with this home when you lose your model you press home and you should win it back that's the thing yeah, it's very sloppy but it will work of course we don't have anything here i guess this will be a nice detail just to have something there just like this and yeah maybe smooth it a little bit to have some edges like this the solidify we need to increase it and it should be fine the solidify if i apply it by the way and then go a alt s i'll be able to make it thicker which is great and then go to scope mode select the same color and just color it all right i guess that's more like it now i kind of like it will this be uploaded it's already uploaded and you will be able to see it everywhere uh all the time would you use these straps for your low poly uh which straps i don't know <laughs> tip of the day press home to win it back <laughs> yes don't permit to say left or right I have to uh, look at my watch. Aha, uh -huh. this is my left hand, so the other one is right. So next to the right shift is the slash key. The slash from where was the slash from? I don't know. So yeah, this will be our stream for today. Let me ask uh, just a few questions to the end, and uh, we'll be. Here. Cheers, Nico. I'm just finishing your old Orborg, uh, old cyborg tutorial. Very good. Going to post it on our station. See you on the next one. Thank you. How often do you do live in Twitch? In Twitch, I don't do it anymore. I used to do them in Twitch. Now I do them in uh, in here in in uh, what is this? YouTube. I forgot the name of the of the YouTube. Who forgets YouTube? Maybe Nico. Nico forgets YouTube. By the way, if I rotate the head a little bit with the beard. 
it will be more interesting. Let's try that. Yeah, now it's better. It's a little bit more interesting when it's asymmetrical, you know. Just rotated, just moved. Ah, just a tiny bit. It looks cooler. Ha! <laughs> In the back, you see? This is what 3D artists leave their meshes, the back of their meshes, when they will not be visible. For example, you're doing this only for the render from the front. Uh, just for uh, for marketing or for something, just for one render from the front. And you pose it and do it and do the render and in the back it looks like this. But it's it's normal. Everything is a lie. Nico is lying to us. Great work as always, Nico. Really inspiring. Thank you for thank you. Thank you very much for the stream, Nico. It was really relaxing to watch out and learn a lot on the way. Yeah, you learned a lot about the gods. You learn a lot about other things, many things, including sculpting probably a little bit. Kratos has a scar on his right eye. Ah, yes, he has a little bit of scar here. Let's do this. Ah, you have to remind me, guys, of those things. I'm not exactly, uh, you know, I don't know any, everything. Let's make it a little bit more interesting like this, like this, like this. And here, okay, Scarman, it's cool, I will not color the scar, it will be just a little scar there, uh, not, not, nothing too much. Can you show him without the beard for a sec? <laughs> I'm not sure you want to see it without the beard really, but let me name this beard. Oops, a beard with A, so it will go to the top, and I will easily... Ah, he's not that bad without the beard, but it doesn't look like Kratos at all without the beard, so... I guess, but let's make him look a little bit better without the beard. Oh, just a tiny bit better. Without symmetry, as you can see, I'm sculpting. Pretty cool. Adding those uh, things that most people don't add, and their mouths look like this. Okay, here I'll add a little bit of a lower lip, but not too much because we don't want to, it to be visible below the beard. <laughs> he looks pretty cool, even without the mighty beard. All right, yeah. I would say it was a very nice idea to look uh, him without the beard. Yeah, we can even leave him like this, it's fine. No, with the beard it's better. He looks much more wise and everything without... Uh, and without the beard, he looks like some kind of, you know, hooligan or some kind of a, a prisoner or whatever guy, some kind of crazy guy. With the beard, he looks more relaxed, more wisdom guy and everything. Super stream had fun, I learned a lot, thanks. Uh, yeah. That's my problem. I'm too much of a professionalist, and I said it's set me back many times. Ha! Huh, yeah, me no. I'm not professionalist, so it never sets me back. So it's cool. It was scarier. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You have five times more uh, viewers in your stream than Pixelogic with so less subscribers. Uh, because I'm uh, very uh, active these days, maybe. And also. And also, very importantly, Blender is more popular than ZBrush. Much more people know about Blender. If you see Blender Guru, he has around 2 million subscribers, I'm not sure. So a lot of people know Blender. And many people want to see how Blender 
is um, kind of doing when sculpting and stuff like this. That's why it's it's so much people are kind of here, I guess. Maybe I should connect the body and the arms, but I don't have time for this, you know. He looks like Sagat from Screen Street Fighter. Let's see. Yeah, a little bit like Sagat. Yeah, really. Yeah, definitely. With this big nose and big chin and everything. <laughs> tudum, 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 tum, 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 tum. Maybe we can put a hat on him and make his beard white and he will be Santa. You know, easy. Easy Santa. What do you think you're going to make next uh, stream? Uh, I don't know exactly because I always choose my concepts on the same day as the stream, so I don't have a slight idea. But well, people are asking for slim and uh, more bony character. I don't know, some kind of zombie or Spider-Man or whatever, we'll see. Maybe Batman, but slim Batman, who knows. Maybe something that is absolutely like... Uh, for example, I'm training from... Uh, let me show you what I did uh, today. Let's name this uh, God of War uh, stream. And let me show you what I did. Uh, this was the God of War test that I did today. It's not bad at all, also. But uh, the stream one is better, I think. So uh, always the, the second one becomes better. This is the girl with the yellow jacket from yesterday. And today I did... Let's see what I did. I did a head. Can I disable everything? Yeah, I did this head. Which is uh, kind of a Chinese... Uh, I tried to do this. I was watching from this head. And uh, yeah, just for like an hour or something. So it's not the best. And I did also this head as i shown you and this was for today this one i tried to be as much as possible but a little bit i kind of made it a little bit more realistic probably uh, i don't know it's fine let's go to our god of war stream yeah amazing guy lucky luke is a cool stream guy slim guy yeah definitely Niku Kaina look like a villain indeed. Do you think so? Are you sure about that? No. I don't know, you know, huh? Pretty nice guy. I'm the good guy. Not the bad guy. Remember that. Yeah. Rasputin probably could be a good choice. Yeah, if we have a nice concept for him, maybe. Rui from Street Fighter, he's not very bony and not very slim. He's pretty thick, I mean, muscular. muscular. So you always practice your models once before stream? It depends. If I, for example, will do this head for practice, or if I will do a skull, or if I will do this head, I probably will not practice because it's kind of, I have did like thousands of those, hundreds probably. But for this guy, I had to practice because I had to see if I will be able to make it in this amount of time, at least to look decent. And it was fine. It was kind of decent, so it's fine. Bruce Lee, Santana. Oh, we have a lot of suggestions. Golem, uh, zombie from zombie infection, something, some, no. We will see. Tomorrow I will just browse our station and choose something. Uh, I don't know if I will stream tomorrow even, but probably I will. I'm, I'm not sure. But these days, I'm on the streak, so I probably will stream. I guess. More or less. Put it in Cycle Slender with good lights, please. I don't uh, know how to do this. <laughs> no, I know how to do it in Cycle Slender, but good light, it takes a lot of time. So I will not be able to do it. Maybe someday. Would you like to try one of the main characters from Arcane, League of Legends? Uh, I've tried them. They're a little bit difficult to, uh, you know, to achieve the likeness. It's not very easy. So, yeah. Use Blender just to convert Blender file to FBX. I use Blender. <laughs> okay, uh, it's your choice. 
Сънича Стефан Хартман. Стефан Хартман. Стефан Хартман. Лорд Раптор. I haven't heard of Lord Raptor. Стефан Хартман. Актор. He's an actor? Why do we need an actor? We don't. Okay. You can suggest uh, everything you want, but I will probably do something that I want at the end. Sorry about that. This Kratos was suggested by, uh, by a viewer, of course, and it's fine. It turns out to be a good choice, but sometimes I just want to do what I want to do. Christian Bale from The Machinist. <laughs> of course, he's very thin. Do you know Arsec Erased from Sofia? No problem, not. Hi Nico, super cool Kratos, some cyberpunk edge runners character. I have to watch cyberpunk edge runner, by the way. I haven't watched the, the series yet. Uh, although I watched Arcane, I'm super impressed. I'm uh, very like the, the series. I hope they make another season. And I think they are making it, I'm not sure. But, but, the Edge Runners, I haven't watched it yet. I don't have Netflix, by the way, a uh, subscription or something. For me, it will be uh, probably to subscribe to Netflix, it will be to kill my creativity, most likely. It will be just watching like this and the saliva coming out from the mouth and uh, all day like a zombie with an ice cream bucket and get fat and everything. It's not a good idea uh, to do this, in my opinion. If you want to continue working and sculpting and developing yourself, uh, Netflix, uh, not so much. Sorry about that, Netflix, if you're watching. If Netflix is watching, please uh, don't be mad. I mean, you know. Okay, we have to finish the stream. It's almost two hours. I tried to make my streams less than two hours. So yeah, thank you very much for watching. This is the best. Uh, no, this is not the best, but this is what we do for two hours. It's fine. Um, making of Arcane on YouTube. I think I watched something like this. I'm not sure. Stefan Hartman. I got the name wrong. He's a Blender artist. Okay, Stefan Hartman. Stefan. Okay, Stefan. Let's see. Stefan. Stefan. Hartman or Hartman, Stefan Hartman, with two N, and our station. He's a blender artist, really, because his work is pretty amazing. Is it blender? It's pretty cool. Let's see if this is blender, for example. Sculpt te te texture and render in blender. Very cool, very cool. So this guy is better than me. Huh. Probably he has a very nice video card. I would say. Is this Blender? Ah, he didn't say. Ah, Photoshop Blender, really? Ha, <laughs> very cool. Wow. This guy is very good, I would say. Let's follow him back. Ah, he's following me. Okay, so follow him back. Why not? Very cool, I will watch his uh, work, he's very inspiring. I, I probably will, uh, I will never do this kind of work. It's a uh, realistic uh, horror stuff and stuff, but it looks pretty cool, I might, I will admit. It's very nice. Oh, he's also a good uh, uh, illustrator. Oh yeah. Studies of Max Verein, Vere, Verein, Verein. Ah, uh, he's a fan of this guy, Max Verehin. Max Verehin has made this this kind of weird looking. Uh, that's uh, what those are reminds me of. Those kind of creepy looking faces. Very cool. Okay. Did I follow him back? Yes, now I follow him back. Awesome, Nico. I'm having a Rakia in your honor. Thank you very much. I will probably have Rakia someday too. I'm not drinking these days. 
because uh, I don't know. I don't need to. I don't drink any alcohol. See you tomorrow. Yeah. See you guys. And goodbye.